Connor Nigel Benn, born September 28, 1996, is a British professional boxer who has held WBA Continental Welterweight title since 2018. He is the son of former two-division world champion Nigel Benn. Ben had a privileged upbringing due to his father Nigel's successful boxing career. Twelve years of his childhood were spent on the Spanish island of Mallorca, too, where he lived with his family in a gated, eight-bedroom mansion with a pool, and had a jacuzzi in his room. 3. Despite this, his father taught him financial self-reliance by never giving him money. Ben said he supported himself by doing painting and decorating in Spain for 20 euros a day, from 6 to 5. He also spent time in Australia where he boxed as an amateur before starting his professional career. Rads Abu Sapovic Butev, born December 15, 1993, is a Russian professional boxer who has held a WBA, regular, welterweight title from October 2021 to April 2022. At regional level he held the WBC NAB Super Welterweight title in 2016. The reigning WBA regular champion Jamal James was ordered to face Butev, who was at the time the number three ranked WBA welterweight contender, in his first title defense. The fight was ordered on February 4, 2021, and the two were given a 30 days to negotiate before a purse bid would be called. 13. The fight was once again ordered on September 26, 2021. 14 and was later scheduled for October 30, 2021. 15. Butev achieved his career best win, as he stopped James by technical knockout at the 2 12 minute mark of the ninth round. David Gavrushevich Avancian, aka David Avancian, is a Russian boxer who held the European welterweight title since 2019. Earlier in his career, he won the WBA, regular, welterweight title in 2017 turned professional 2009, his records show, the welterweight boxer has a total of 30 fights, winning 26 of them in one draw. Pyat Igorsk, Stavropol Kray I, Soviet Union native, David Ivansian was born on 15th of August 1988, under the star sign Leo. He holds a Russian nationality and is of Armenian ethnic background. The third I two years old stands 1.73 meters, 5 feet 8 in and weighs 174 centimeters, 69 in. Aminda Stanyanis, born August 17, 1994, is a Lithuanian professional boxer who has held a WBA, regular, welterweight title since April 2022. As an amateur, he won a gold medal at the 2015 European Championships in the welterweight bracket. I was, always winning, 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 said Stanyanis, who was raised by his mother, Ice Zidilikiin, and maternal grandparents after his father departed when he was two years old. I've been fighting my whole life. My dad left us when I was a kid. My mother raised me and she's the toughest person that I know. Ice finally took her son to a local gym, where he learned mixed martial arts and, eventually, laced on a pair of boxing gloves at the age of 13 even though his head was often handed to him. That's what motivated me to come back said Stanyanis. When you're always winning and you lose, you want to get back at the guy who beat you. That's what kept me coming back to boxing. I always like using my hands, Keith Fitzgerald Thurman Jr., born November 23, 1988, is an American professional boxer. He is a former unified welterweight world champion, having held the WBA title from 2015 to 2019 promoted to super champion in 2017, and the WBC title from 2017 to 2018. As of February 2022, he is ranked as the world's second best active welterweight by box rec. Thurman has earned nearly all of his victories by knockout. And a number of them have come against some of the most rugged participants in a rugged sport. To wit, Thurman burst onto the national scene with a savage four-round destruction of former world champion Carlos Quintana in November 2012. Quintana retired after the brutal loss. From there, Thurman would hand no-nonsense Argentinian Diego Chaves his first defeat via 10th round knockout, winning an interim 147-pound title in the process, before gaining a 9th round technical knockout of Mexican tough guy Supreme Jesus Soto Quiris.
In his last bout as interim champion, Thurman won a unanimous decision over Italian star Leonard Bundu in Las Vegas on December 13, 2014. Virgil Ortiz Jr., born March 25, 1998, is an American professional boxer. He has held the WBO International Welterweight title since 2021. As an amateur, he was a seven-time national champion and was the winner at the 2013 Junior Olympics. 2. He was named 2019 The Ring Magazine Prospect of the Year. 3. Ortiz is known for his punching power, with a knockout-to-win percentage of 100%. His last fight was May 4, 2019 and it was a huge step up in terms of competition and recognition. Due to several circumstances, Ortiz's fight was elevated to the co-main event of Canelo vs. Jacobs. Ortiz took on former WBA interim super lightweight champion Mauricio El Maestro Herrera, which he won in spectacular fashion via a third-round knockout. Ortiz is currently undefeated and has won every bout by way of knockout. His next fight will be for the vacant WBA gold welterweight title against Antonio Relentless Orozco on August 10, Grand Prairie, Texas, which will be the first hometown fight of his professional career. Ortiz plans to continue his knockout streak over his toughest opponent to date, Jaron Ennis, born June 26, 1997, is an American professional boxer. As an amateur, he won a silver and gold medal at the U.S. National Golden Gloves Championships in 2014 and 2015 respectively. Ennis made his professional debut on April 30, 2016, defeating Corey Muldrew via first-round knockout, KO, at the Dixie Center in St. George, Utah. He fought a further seven times in 2016, scoring four consecutive stoppage wins over Luis Ramos in May, Deshaun Debus in June. Tavo Rusty in July, and Matt Murphy in August. Ennis went the distance for the first time in September, defeating Eddie Diaz by unanimous decision, UD, in a scheduled four-round bout. He saw out the year with two more stoppage wins over Chris Alexander in November and Marcus Beckford in December. He began 2017 with a first-round KO victory over Elvin Perez in January, followed by the second decision win of his career out against James Winchester in March. Ennis had a further seven fights in 2017, winning all seven by stoppage, Eduardo Flores in May, Wilfredo Acuna and Robert Hill in June, Ricardo Cano in August, Lionel Jimenez in September, i.e. Bruce in October, and George Sosa in December, Yordanis Yigas Hernandez, born July 14, 1986, is a Cuban professional boxer who has held a WBA, Super, welterweight title from January 2021 to April 2022, having previously held a WBA, regular, title from 2020 until being elevated to super champion. He also challenged for the WBC welterweight title in 2019. As an amateur he won a gold medal at the 2005 World Championships and bronze at the 2008 Olympics, both in the lightweight division. As of October 2021, he is ranked as the world's third best active welterweight by the Transnational Boxing Rankings Board, The Ring Magazine and Box Rec. He is also ranked as the eighth best active boxer, pound for pound, by Box Rec. Yuga's nickname, 54 Milagros, comes from two people. 54 refers to baseball player Roldis Chapman who wears the number 54, and is Yuga's best friend. Milagros is the name of Yuga's mother, Errol Spence Jr., born March 3, 1990, is an American professional boxer. He is currently a unified welterweight world champion, having held the IBF title since May 2017, the WBC title since September 2019, and the WBA, Super, since April 2022. As an amateur in the welterweight division, he won three consecutive United States national championships and represented the U.S. at the 2012 Olympics, where he reached the quarterfinals. In 2015, Spence was named Prospect of the Year by ESPN. As of August 2021, Spence is ranked as the world's fourth best active boxer, pound for pound, by Box Rec, Boxing Writers Association of America and ESPN, fifth by TBRB and 6th by The Ring Magazine. 8. He is also ranked as the world's best active welterweight by The Ring, 
and TBRB, and second by Box Rec, and ESPN. His knockout to win ratio stands at 78%. Terrence Allen Crawford, born September 28, 1987, is an American professional boxer. He has held multiple world championships in three weight classes, including the WBO welterweight title since 2018. Previously he held the WBO and Ring Magazine lightweight titles from 2014 to 2015, and the unified WBA, Super, WBC, IBF, WBO and Ring light welterweight titles between 2015 and 2017. In August 2017, Crawford had a short reign as the undisputed light welterweight champion, prior to moving up to welterweight. He was the first undisputed champion at light welterweight since Kostchitz Zoo in 2004. Crawford also became the first male boxer to simultaneously hold all four major world titles in boxing, WBA, WBC, IBF and WBO, since your main tailor in 2005 and is one of only six male boxers in history to do so. As of November 2021, Crawford is ranked as the world's second best active boxer, pound for pound, by ESPN, third by Boxing Writers Association of America, and fourth by TBRB, Box Rec and The Ring Magazine. He is also ranked as the world's best active welterweight by ESPN, Box Rec, and The Ring, and second by the TBRB. Crawford was named Fighter of the Year by the Boxing Writers Association of America in 2014, and by ESPN in 2014 and 2017. Stylistically, Crawford is known for his exceptionally fast hand speed, ring IQ, punching power, counter-punching abilities and defensive skills, as well as his ability to comfortably switch hit from orthodox to southpaw.